Welcome back, Air Gunners. And it's been about a week since I spoke to you guys last, and we're going to finish up the third part of our three-part series on introducing children or kids to air guns. First part being um, some tips, five tips that you may want to use if you're going through that process. The second part was looking at the BSA Ultra JSR, which is an air gun that I would highly recommend. Uh, a little bit pricier than some kids' air rifles, but also a very quality product that's going to be able to grow with the kid. Um, and now it's time to kind of look at, as an adult, you know, we want to have some fun too. What's a good rifle that we could use to shoot alongside with the kids or if we're just looking for an air gun that's a good solid contender without breaking the bank we've got that here too so that being the bsa ultra se this is the tactical version there's also a version that comes with a regular beach stock which is then stained in walnut very similar to the jsr stock uh, a couple of differences though between this and the jsr would be that obviously this is a um polycarbonate molded uh, stock. This does come with swivel studs. So it is, uh, BSA is looking at this as more of their all weather type of stock. If you're going to take this into the field. Um, the trigger guard is also something of notable difference too. There is no access to adjust the trigger from the outside as there would be on the wood stock. So if you have the tactical stock, you're going to need to be able to take that stock off, adjust the trigger and put it back on. Now for me, that is not a big deal. I do that with every air gun that I use. I always want to take the stock off. That way I can get in there and really fine tune things and I'm not um, hindered in any way by trying to work around a different piece of the air gun. So that's not not a deal breaker for me at all some other things this does come in at one pound heavier uh, than the JSR remember a pound difference for a kid is a lot of difference uh, this is coming in at about five point or five pounds nine ounces and uh, fully equipped now seven pounds ten ounces out the door again this is one pound heavier the overall length out of the box is 32 inches when I've gone ahead and added the Donnie FL moderator to that it does increase it to 34 inches but again this does have the one half UNF threads in it and I would definitely recommend a moderator for this as it does have a little bit of a bark out of the box without being moderated so keep that in mind as you're shopping around Otherwise, this is the exact same air gun as its smaller brother, the BSA Ultra JSR. Has that same two-stage trigger, same cylinder, same barrel, same action, same bolt handle, same magazines, you name it, it's the same. So it also comes with that 11 millimeter dovetail uh, for your scope. This gives us, a, it's neat being able to test two air guns that are essentially the same, the stock being the biggest difference, and to see if there's consistency between the product. Out of the box, I was getting a trigger pull at one pound seven ounces, which is very comparable to uh, the trigger for the JSR. And then again, uh, group-wise, as I took this out, ran it through all the same tests that I would normally run any air gun. And at 50 yards, I was getting groups at 0.44 inches center to center, uh, very consistent groups as well. And the pellets were a little bit different. This air gun happened to like the JSB exacts a little bit better than some of the other varieties. But again, JSB being the pellet of choice uh, for both this and the uh, BSA Ultra JSR. Finally, chronograph data. Again, this is the same gun, so it should be similar. Well, it is, and I got 38 consistent shots out of this before it really fell off uh, the power curve. And to keep track of those shots, again, I'm gonna suggest that you just run three magazines. Three magazines will get you up to 30 shots, and then it'll be time to obviously uh, refill the magazines and refill the gun. So. Another excellent option here for those of you who are looking for something different, maybe a father-son uh, combination, grandparent, grandchild combination, mother-daughter combination, whatever that may be, this and the BSA Ultra JSR could be that for you. So until next time, guys, may your trigger pull stay smooth and your pellets fly straight. And we're gonna see you right here on the Airgun Advisor.